again, I'm trying to make a video. People keep calling me, and it keeps messing them up. So, basically, I'm going to be showing you how to, well, my way at least, how to make your wheel and rims, well, tires basically, uh, shine and look a little bit better without washing them, washing them with water or anything. So there, I mean, there's a lot of brown stuff on here. It's pretty dirty right now. The uh, actual rims. Um, there's a couple, There's some dust, as you can see. Some black stuff on my finger. So I'm gonna show you each product I got on hand that I'm gonna be uh, using. I did the uh, other three wheels. Um, they came out pretty good actually. But uh, first up. We're gonna be using this one. This is a. Um, this is from Adams. This is an all-purpose cleaner. All-purpose means it pretty much anything really. And we're gonna be spraying it on this dedicated wheel, rim, and uh, what are these called? Wheel wells, uh, rag. So let's see. I'm gonna spray it where it's dirtiest, so I can have other place, dry places to buff it out with. Okay, so spray some on there. Now what I'm gonna do is just kind of wipe down the whole wheel. This will probably get you know most of the dirt and stuff off of it. Hold on, get a little bit more. Probably wondering why I don't just spray it on the tire, but I don't want overspray getting on the rims or anything. So I'm just gonna wipe it on there. Okay, now that it's on there pretty good, get one more dot. Pretty much all the dirt and stuff's gone. I'm gonna flip my rag over and kind of just dry it off. Okay, that step is done. Now we are going to use the same rag actually. We're going to be using this uh, Adams Detail Spray. Um, this one I'm going to spray on there, but not heavily, just a very light stream going across the wheel. Okay, that's it. So now we just kind of spread it around in there a little bit. Oh my god. My car is making some, like, very like weird beeping noises and stuff. I don't know if you can hear it. I don't know if you can though. <laughs> so, got the detail spray spread out. Let's flip our cloth once again. We're just gonna dry it off again. I hate when it does this, it's kind of annoying. It mostly happens when I'm taking a video or something or doing something to the car. Dude, it's just getting louder. Okay. The detail step is done. We're done with that rag. Sorry if that if you hear that noise, it might be bothering you, but I don't know. Okay. Next step. I have not reviewed this product, but I will soon. This is by Mothers. It's a pure Brazilian carnauba wax. Ultimate shine and lasting protection. You obviously must use this on your paint and things like that. But we're going to be, to be just using them um, on the wheels for right now. It's a pretty big bottle. I'll do a review on this stuff later. It smells really good too. So we got this, uh, it's not a microfiber, but it's the normal foam pad. We're going to lay a very thin line across it like this. Just like that. We're going to dab it like a cross. So, one, two, three, four. 
Then we'll just spread it around. We're gonna do this two times. Make sure we get everything covered. That's one time, then we'll do it again. Crap. Do the cross thing. Get the outer walls and stuff. Up. We're going to actually clean the rooms and then we got one more step after that. So I got this cheap $1 uh, microfiber I'm going to be using for my rooms and things. So first off we're going to get our detail spray one more time. Right here. We're going to spray a little bit in this rag. Then we're going to just wipe it on the rooms and clean it up a little bit. Keeps falling on me. Uh, damn, I heard somebody coming outside. Okay, it ain't perfect, but pretty much all the stuff's wiped off of it. Now we are going to fold it one more time. We're actually going to put a uh, very, we're going to be using the standard turtle wax stuff, so it's, it's easy to get off when I want to do something else to the room. So we're going to spray a little bit, hold on, got to find my, my side, so we're going to be spray a little bit right here, wipe it on again. So this is ain't like a permanent thing or whatever. It's just a quick thing to do. Well, it's not exactly quick, but I mean, it's a thing to do without water. It makes it look pretty okay, in my opinion. So now that it's on, I'm gonna flip the towel to another side and just uh, buff it off or just wipe it off. Now, the last step, I love this stuff. I got another bottle coming soon, hopefully. Um, this is Adam's Tire Shine, it looks really good. I like this stuff a lot. So we got our uh, wheel thing here. Put three lines. And we'll just spread it around and then we'll do one more line, spread it around and do another line. Hopefully you start to see a difference already. It's a weird angle for the camera, but you should be able to tell that it's uh, looking better. Man, this, this video is eight minutes long. Holy crap. Hopefully I don't run out of space. It's probably will. Hopefully not, though. Okay, so we're going to do one more line and get the uh, outer walls and stuff. Like in here and whatnot. But that already, was that my first or second line? I don't know. Let me do one more dot. I don't remember. <laughs> Either way, it's shined up clean. Okay, and that's pretty much it. I have it on the front face, so it's kind of weird to hold it. But you can see it's pretty, looks pretty good. Better than it did in the beginning. 
So now I'm going to end this video here. I'm going to pull a car forward, uh, get that bottom piece right there to come up here somewhere, and then finish it off with some more tire shine, and that'll be it. So, uh, yeah.